Yo, I'm the 2KMC, and since the holiday season is upon us, I'm in a giving mood. Let's go over all the upcoming events in the city. Today, head to Club 2K sponsored by Beats. Beats, buckets, what more could you ask for? After that, it's the 90s, so you better be ready to throw it back. During the week, check out Annie Up, Wacky Wednesday, and more Club 2K. Lots of events, lots of opportunities. And for more weekend fun, head to Rival Day Conquest and Rival Day Championship. Invade other territories in your quest to become a true champion of the city. See you on the courts. 2KMC out. Welcome to a new episode of NBA 2K TV. I'm Alexis Morgan. And I'm Chris Manning. First up, he's probably one of the best known personalities in the NBA. He's a dear friend to us here at 2K TV, and it's kind of a tradition to have him on every single year. Yes, it's time to check in with the one, the only, Shaq. Welcome back to 2K TV. We're so excited to have you back on the show. I need to ask you because I was watching your season one interview and you were talking about what you do every day. And it was like, wake up, take a shower, maybe drink some coffee. I don't know, it was something like that. And then you said that you watch Jerry Springer and Maury, Maury Povich. every day. Every day. I have to ask why. When I come here to do these things, I always start at 12.30, which gives me perfect timing. I don't want to say I laugh at the people, but I, <laughs> I, like, <laughs> I like looking at that type of uh, content in the morning. It's fun and it's part of my ritual. I've always been a creature of habit. No, don't shake it. Let it, let it. <laughs> let it settle. It's not nasty though. They don't think they taste good. Some video right here. So you took a wheatgrass shot yesterday. Can't do that. It's good, right? Yeah, wheatgrass tastes like cut grass. Yeah, that's why I don't like it. I can't do the grass. I didn't, I didn't like it. People on the set, they, they challenged me, but wheatgrass tastes like wet grass. It does. I kind of feel like I'm eating what's left over in the lawnmower. I thought I was the only one who thought that way. <laughs> wow, we're related. Nice we to see are you. related. Nano, I don't have the height, nano, but... Nano, Nano. Remember that? Nano, <laughs> Nano. Remember that? Mark and Mindy? <laughs> no idea, but right. I'm just going to go along you with it. You never watch Mark and Mindy? No. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's talk basketball now. Yes. Who's your favorite big man in the game today? Well, Giannis, but Giannis, he doesn't play the right. big man position, but I like his size. I like his ability. Uh, kind of jealous of him. I wish I was able to, to do that full time. I did it every now and then just mm -hmm. to get the crowd out of their feet, but he does it every game for full time. So to answer your question, Giannis, but the game has, they use the word evolve. I, I, I like to use the word devolve. I don't like to see guys shooting threes and doing all that stuff, but. Is there anyone today who maybe has little inklings of what the centers were back when you were uh, playing? Th they all have preferred tastes. Mm -hmm. So as a big man, you either prefer to be on the inside or you prefer to be on the outside. And these guys these days, I, they just like being on the outside. We were here today and we switched things up a little bit. You are featured as a special guest alongside Kevin Harlan. How is that? That's awesome. I like to work. I like to do my job. <laughs> Me and you go back since the McDonald's All-American game we in 1989. Yeah. We do. <laughs> You're you nice guys. to remember that. Yeah, I do. <laughs> you guys have a history, huh? We, we do. do. I remember Man. saying his name and give it a long Shaquille O'Neal. Oh, that sounds great. <laughs> say it again. Throw he wants you to say it again. I want to shoot. <laughs> What's your favorite thing about working with 2K? They they understand, they make the job very easy. I, th I think they study us and know how how we sound and what we would say, and they have it in the order that they want to say it. It's just actually easy. Nice. You said that you might rap or sing. Me, me and you sing? We could, I could sing too. All right, well, what would you sing with? Okay, so we've got some topics. Barbecue chicken. Yes. Any songs or <laughs> raps? barbecue chicken? <laughs> barbecue chicken? No. <laughs> Why don't you try? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Give me a beat. <laughs> Barbecue chicken, <laughs> like my Mickin. <laughs> oh, okay, it's a part of the thicken. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, oh but you tricking. <laughs> oh, thank you. Because you... Oh, you just made my day. You cooking it in the kitchen. <laughs> Hey, We're going to put these in the bloopers, uh, but this is not going the regular yeah, so interview. Yeah, going on no. interview. <laughs> put this on so you can have a disguise. So, hey, that's the girl that rhymes Micken with chicken. <laughs> Mom, what's Micken? <laughs> oh. This is the best interview I've ever had in my life. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, All barbecue right, chicken. Uh, that's it for us today on 2K TV. <laughs> we will see you guys next time. <laughs> Now it's time for some 2K TV Interactive, brought to you by Curry Brand and the newly released Curry 8s. When we interviewed Shaq last year, he put together his ultimate starting five. So which of these current players made his roster? Was it Anthony Davis, Giannis Antetokounmpo, Stephen Curry, or Kawhi Leonard. That is a whole lot of talent. And it may be a bit of a trick question, so answer carefully. Shaq's top five. My team. I got Michael Jordan, Kobe Bryant, LeBron James, myself, and Pistol Pete Maravich. Mm, how many games you guys have? Actually, I'm going to trade Pistol Pete for Steph Curry, because he's my favorite player right now. And Steph's latest signature shoe, the Curry 8, is available now. So, our 2K TV interactive question is, when did Stephen Curry release his first signature shoe with Under Armour? Was it 2014, 2015, 2016, or 2017? That's a hard question. That is a hard question. That's the era of the Warriors. It was, and speaking of the Warriors, I have them on the back of my jacket. Take a look, it's really cool. I love it. How to change hoop shoes for good. Discover the new formula, drop the rubber, stop the slipping, made it feel unreal. Blew his mind, blew their minds. Now change the game for good. Everyone needs a little help from time to time and dime to dime. It's me, the 2K MC, and it's time for the State Farm Top Assists of the Month. Featuring the best assists you've sent in. Pass me some top plays pronto. Light it up, man! There it is. Oh, man, my bad. <laughs> That's a straight, man. There it is. Our first top play is from Big Six Water in the wreck. A great assist can catch the defense off guard. This behind-the-back heat seeker finds the cutter and stride for a deceptive deuce. Our next clip is from the Pro-Am with TZK 10063C. Pronouncing that handle was worth it, considering the way they handled this behind-the-back pass. Leaping left-handed dime on the mark for a wide-open three for the team. That's a playmaker in their prime. Showing some love in my team, it's Joe Leister. Rebounds with McCollum, long lead pass to Westbrook for the showcase jam. Check this out, not cherry picking, just quick thinking and breakneck speed. Lightning score, four seconds flat. One play left and one second left in the wreck. It's goaded CRC. You wanna shock somebody? Deliver the ball by ground man. Bounces the game-winning assist to stun everyone in the building. Impressive assists. Vote now for your favorite State Farm Top Assist of the Month. Hey, and don't forget that you can submit your top plays to social media using the hashtag 2KTVWOW. I'm the 2KMC. Don't forget to pass the ball, everybody. See you next time. Ho, 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 I'm Brian, but right now you can call me Brian Claus because I'm here to discuss the 12 days of giving in my team. During the next 12 days, you'll be able to earn some sweet prizes in my team. 
Each day will offer you the chance to pick up a rare player, an ornament ball, which you'll need to eventually earn the fireball, plus gold or maybe even a Hall of Fame badge. Now the players will change every day, which means you can almost fill out an entire My Team lineup during these 12 days of giving. The only question is, which cards will you unwrap this holiday season? Carmelo Anthony is vocal about social justice. He recently partnered with us and penned an open letter as part of our Uninterrupted series. Here is Sincerely Yours, Carmelo Anthony. Dear 2020 and beyond, it has been several lifetimes of oppression and injustice towards people that look like me. History has shown us that there are moments when the fabric of our country will show itself in ways we cannot ignore. And for me, one of those moments was four and a half years ago, the week of July 4th, 2016. Alton Sterling and Philando Castile have been killed by law enforcement. The footage documenting their murders raced through my mind. Unsure what to do, I decided to write what I was feeling. Feelings of frustration, mental exhaustion, and concern for our people's future. Feelings demanded that these senseless killings stop. That was 2016. Four and a half years later, 400 years later, and we're still here. George Floyd, Breonna Taylor, Rayshard Brooks, the list of black people killed by law enforcement grows and grows. There's so much work to be done. Our basic human rights hang in the balance with politicians and agendas that don't seem to make our lives a priority. The shooting of Jacob Blake in Wisconsin during the middle of 2020 NBA playoffs again put racism on front street. Some may wonder why athletes have such a reaction to these incidents, but we are all human first, black men first. And so we had to take a moment to process and decide how we could influence the change we wish to see in this country. A movement instead of a moment. We're confronted almost daily with both our own experiences as well as traumatic videos of police misconduct. We repeatedly witness black people being killed for things others are allowed to walk away from. We march for these victims and we protest the systemic racism that perpetuates this tragic cycle. No matter who you are, a mother, father, NBA player, nurse, teenager, we're all humans. It affects us all, at least it should. On top of everything, we're in the midst of a global pandemic, one that disproportionately affects people of color. We're losing grandparents, uncles, aunts, loved ones. We're worried about our health, our safety, our jobs, our future. There's no denying the tremendous mental toll it takes to be black in America. But we're starting to understand how important our mental well-being is and how detrimental it can be when it goes unchecked. We have to not only deal with our own mental health, but own it. Acknowledge it. No one should feel ashamed to seek the support they need. So what does caring for your mental health look like? At the end of the day, Try to find a healthy outlet amidst the tension and conflict. Our fight for social justice has been and will be a long journey. As we demand the change we want, we best position ourselves to achieve those results when we value and care for ourselves and others. Reach out to your friends, your family, your neighbors. Talk to them, check in, see how they doing. Share how you are doing. Trust your thoughts and feelings to those in your life. Being vulnerable is not being weak. It takes strength and courage to be open. Sincerely, Carmelo Anthony. The holidays are right around the corner, and even better, the NBA is about to return. You know what else is about to start back up? Some gift giving. So what are you getting me, Chris? The gift of basketball, games and more games. And I might even send over a Laker championship hat because that would look wonderful on you. You know what would look great on you? My dubs jacket. So then we'll call it even. But next week, we are celebrating the tip off of the 2020-21 NBA season. You won't want to miss it. See you next time. Bye. I'm the 2KMC, 
And since the holiday season is upon us, I'm in a giving mood. Let's go over all of the upcoming events in the neighborhood. Get started with Rush 3v3. Win four games in a row to win exclusive Rush gear, VC, and more. On Wednesday, it's Court Conqueror, where you can earn prizes for getting in some four-on-four -four action. Next weekend, head to Big Top Challenge. Big heads, big fun. And if you're also in a giving mood, then head to Dime Time, where you'll work with the community to reach the assist goal and have a chance to win VC, attribute boosts, and more. See you on the courts. 2KMC out.